Miso Customs Puddle Light on off switch. Just gonna put the switch in. Switches in. Go. I'm talk, uh, just gonna pull these panels up and off so we can get to the wiring harnesses. We gotta take that little round little bolt off of there. It's a fun one to try to reach. Just grab the front and the back of the panel and pull it, and it'll pop out. Go ahead. Okay, so now you got the panel off, you can see your wiring harness. It's this white one right here. Push on the button, pull it out. It's gonna be pretty obvious. That'll go into the big one. Oh, I'm sorry, right now I'm doing the passenger one. I need this one. Go. Then we'll have a 10 millimeter bolt that we're gonna put this grounding wire onto. Okay, so here's the passenger side wiring harness. I did undo the small plug from the driver side harness. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this up over here as well. Can we pull that off first? There we go. These panels are tight. White white harness. Get it into the harness. Right way would be good too.
There we go. All right, so this wire, we need to feed over to the driver's side. We're gonna pull this panel here off. So let it drop down and then back here just feed it behind and then you'll go over to the other side and pull that panel off and grab hold of wire and there's the wire you'll feed this back up into your dash and you'll hook it back up on right now no okay. go ahead all right so now we got the switch we got three different positions we have the on position to turn them in they're on now you got an off position where you can just turn them off and not have them running at all or go into your auto mode which will be controlled with your key as you lock and unlock now all you have left is put the panels back together tuck the wire back up however you see fit and it's a wrap